I'm David Deserto with my 60 plus second review of British director Otto Bathurst's revisionist Robin Hood, starring Taron Egerton as the iconic Prince of Thieves, Ben Mendelsohn as the wicked Sheriff of Nottingham, and Jamie Foxx as a Muslim Little John. Now there is a guy who shoots arrows, but that's where the similarity ends with the Robin Hood of popular legend. Instead, Bathurst opts to subvert existing mythology, depicting Robin as a disillusioned, anti-establishment rebel, inciting the oppressed commoners to mob violence, tapping into today's political and anarchist zeitgeist. But the real villain in the film is the evil, corrupt church, or at least the filmmaker's perverse perception of it, personified by F. Murray Abraham's cardinal, sinister to the point of caricature. True, the storybook Robin had little patience for corrupt clergy, but the character was a pious son of the church. Traditional tales abound with references to his Marian devotion, his praying the rosary, and refusal to leave Mass even when his life was in danger. In fact, post-Reformation faithful Catholics in England were referred to as Robin Hoods. The shameful, self-inflicted scandals currently plaguing the church no doubt make such anti-Catholic cliches more palatable for mainstream audiences. But the film's abysmal misrepresentation of the church and what it teaches would be laughable if it were not so offensive. Now, my mother taught me if you don't have something nice to say, well, don't say anything. So apart from some stylish, deftly choreographed action set pieces, 